Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really bout this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lies All the time, stand on it If we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this? No, we don't allow it Yo, what is good, J.I. Squad, and welcome back to yet again another banger video, man. It's your boy J.I., and I'm back at it again with another one for you guys, man. So, if you're new to the channel, let's go ahead and start this video off by hitting that subscribe button for the kid and turn on those post notifications so you can join the J.I. Squad, and you won't miss any of these bangers that we're uploading. As you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail, in today's video, we're going to be talking about one of the topics that you guys really would like me to base majority of my videos on I know that it would help the channel tremendously but just me personally and my morals and stuff like that it clashes and I'm gonna show you guys the reasons why it clashes and hopefully after this video you guys can understand why I don't be street racing but first it's 2023 man every year we all sit and set these resolutions that don't really last or we don't really you know stick through me personally I've fallen victim of this multiple years for sure but one thing that I want to do this year is just increase my consistency across the board as you guys know I've been doing YouTube for a hot minute and I've been mad consistent on YouTube um, I've started to kind of venture off into TikTok and Instagram and stuff like that I want to say last year and the year before that my fitness life was crazy like I was very very on top of it always going to the gym every single day and consistent kind of letting myself go as far as consistency goes for the gym I don't really be going too, too often or too much or as I used to as much as I used to so this year the goal is to get back into my fitness life um, and just like I said be more consistent all around so with that being said we're gonna go ahead and turn on Vader hop in Vader and we're gonna go to the gym get a quick workout in and then after that we'll hit the showers and we'll get on with this video so let's get this cold start and let's get it going and we're in the JIHQ right now so this is gonna be live y'all as y'all can see just finished a good workout man great workout super stoked to be back on track man now let's head back to the crib hit the showers and get ready for work and we'll go ahead and get into this vlog all right you guys so let's go ahead and jump straight into the actual topic of this video why don't i go to mexico there is a lot of reasons why i don't street race is basically what i'm talking about man and honestly the main reason is exactly what happened to my guy kevin van voris man so basically man i'm a youtuber and with that being said street racing content is content that is out on the internet really and truly all the content that i make is out on the internet for everybody to see since it's illegal and all the content that is put on this channel and all of my social media platforms is literally open to the public. It's like I'm snitching on myself. You feel me? Like the police are literally able to access my YouTube account. They're able to access my Instagram account. They're able to access my TikTok account. Just like you guys are at JI Productions. Um, some of those platforms have underscores some of them don't just type in ji productions and it should pop up for you but yeah man they're able to see all of that content just like you guys are able to see all of that content so it's like bro either a i could get caught up by the police on the streets of mexico or b i could end up like kevin van Voris or even some of the others he's not the only one that this has happened to there's a couple people um in the youtube um, community in the automotive space that have got caught up just because they post videos street racing 
and I'm not trying to be one of them. I'm going to be completely honest. It doesn't even have to be street racing. It could be um, like Street Speed 717 who got caught up um, when he jumped his TRX and they were upset that he was driving his truck through a pond even though he was on private property that was owned by his friend and he got permission from his friend. He still had thousands and thousands of dollars worth of fines he had to pay that I'm not trying to pay or go to jail for which was his alternative it was either he spent time in jail or he had to pay like I can't really speak too much on his situation as well because you know or um Street Speed 717 situation neither because it's not mine you feel me I don't know all the details and stuff like that but I'm just saying these are prime examples everything that I'm putting out on this channel I'll say it again is for the public to view i'm not trying to get caught up man as simple as that and like i said about either getting caught up on the streets or getting caught up literally on you know social media i have a baby girl on the way now if you guys haven't seen the video of the gender reveal make sure you guys go check it out but i have a baby girl on the way now which goes into the simple fact that i have way too much to lose um to be out here racing on the street when I could go to the track and pay about $30 to run. And leading to that, I go to the track because it's a controlled space. There's no possibility. Well, there's a couple possibilities that I could crash, but those are on me. If, you know, I go with a tire that is basically bald and I have no traction or I'm spinning and I don't get out. But at the end of the day, I can control that. On the street, you can't control the people around you. Even if you're not street racing, if you're driving normal, like when I got in an accident, when I got rear-ended, you can do everything right, but you can't control the person next to you. So that being said, it's like, you never know what could happen on the street. That's why I don't do it. So for those of you who want me to get into it or are upset with me because I don't get into it, I hope you understand why I don't. And if you don't, I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? If you don't want to watch the channel no more, or you don't want to subscribe to the channel, or you want to unsubscribe, please, by all means, go ahead. Do what you must. I'm not forcing you to be here. Would I love it for you to stay? Hell yeah. But if you don't want to stay, you don't have to. Simple as that. The track is our opening up. This is going to be the last year for Houston Raceway, but I'm going to try my best to have Vader at almost every event out there. My baby is set to be born during Texas 2K. So I'm gonna try my best to get him to the track out there and get some content for you guys. But if I can't, please understand and I'm sorry, but just know Vader is about to go through a very big transformation. So just stay tuned for that. But I hope this video kind of cleared up, you know, any questions that you guys may have about that and answered, you know, let you guys know like why I don't do it and if I am or if I'm not. Like, I hope it's just clear. I hope it's clear. And it's gonna wrap it up for today's video. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a comment in the comment section down below. Go ahead and tap in with all of my other social medias as well. Like I said, it's JI Productions on, I'm on all platforms. I'm gonna end this one here. I'm gonna go ahead and roll that outro and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh yeah, if you saw the video where I talked about getting a trunk or the diffuser like i said i ordered one and they should be here this week so yeah turn that post notification on for real